welcome back to Ready Bear Rick guys. Hope you're doing really well. So in today's very quick video, we're just going to be taking a look at the different home environments that are available on the Oculus Quest 2. And we're also going to go into the settings to see how you can change it to 90 hertz when you're in the home environment. So let's uh, go into settings, virtual environments. Okay. So firstly, this is one of the new environments I'm on. I quite like this one. It looks quite crisp and clear. And there's a nice view over there. But there's a second one here. A bit boring. <laughs> Not much to look at, just bubbles floating around. But if you like it, you like it. Not for me personally. Pass through, that was already on the quest, the original quest. And here's a new one I downloaded. Let's take a look at this. Ooh. I haven't actually looked at this one yet. I just downloaded it. I quite like it. You've got the fish in the pond. You've got a nice view there. Mountain in the background. Ooh, nice Oculus symbol there. In your, I guess it could be a dojo. I'm not too sure, but it looks neat. Very nice. Okay. So, uh, we need to go on to experimental features under settings. As you can see, I've already set it to 90 hertz. So, increase your display refresh rate to 90 hertz when you're in your home, virtual home environment, including apps like Oculus Browser, TV. Turning on this feature may affect the visual quality of Guardian and pass through. Uh, I think the Guardian still works for me. Let's have a look. Yep. Let's check over here as well. Yeah, it seems fine. Which is cool. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, you know, give it a like. I'd really appreciate that. And if you want to see my future content on uh, virtual reality, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell notification. Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers.